fresh off a 10-run run rule victory over Western Illinois in the first game of the doubleheader on this Wednesday afternoon in Columbia. The 20th ranked Missouri Tigers retake the field looking for back-to-back -back wins today heading into their SEC home opener Friday night against Auburn. Lace through the right side. Wilmus is five for five in the doubleheader. First game, trying to get her out of the game maybe a little bit quicker. Moore to right for the second straight game. Hattie Moore has a two-run homer in the first inning. It's her 10th of the year to match Kim Wirt for the team lead. Carlin been throwing her outside for the last couple pitches. She does a good job sitting back and taking that high pitch. Moore only has two hits today, but they've both been first inning two run Such homers. It's a different motion. You're so used to throwing the ball underhand and trying to spin the ball and hit locations. Strikeout for Schumacher. That's her third. Floats it into shallow center, and there's a classic Jenna Laird base hit. Little looper for a single. And Missouri has a one out base runner on Laird's first hit of the day. 2-0. Kessinger pops it into short center. Long run in for Ely. Long run out for Hollings, who almost had it. Speaking of any hit is a good hit when you're struggling. Kayla Kessinger will Here's take it. Gotten this inning have not been hard hit. She has really good spin on the ball. A double into the right center field gap for Emma Robbie. Should clear the bases, and it will. Three run double with two outs, and it's a five nothing Missouri lead in the third. Had a really had a tough ball. She fouled off. That ball is outside. It's not even a strike. She does a good job going with the pitch. And you can see the Tigers are starting to adjust at the plate. Schumacher. Two shot roller to second, handled by Honnold, and Missouri is out of the inning. No runs on two hits. The base is left loaded. And not that she was an automatic out, but she was not seeing a lot of success at the plate. And Coach Malvo has really developed her swing. How about that? Second home run of the game, third of the doubleheader, team leading 11th of the year for Hattie Moore. A player who hit under 200 just three years ago. She has 11 homers before the end of March as a senior. Missouri has adjusted really well. That ball was more inside. It's more of an inside out swing. She does a good, just a good job of staying on it. And she, her swing has changed from Schumacher makes quick work, though, of Henson. Second time Henson has gone down on strikes. The fifth K for Schumacher in the ball game. So they've, been, they've done a good job of taking advantage of where the defense is playing. Here's Amy Ill. She goes to short for Laird. On the move, low throw. Ill is out. Close play at first base. Laird's throw dug out by Frizzell. Western Illinois inches away from a first run of the day. Over 10 against Georgia this weekend, looking for a clean 12 innings and a doubleheader sweep. And they've got it. Six strikeouts in a complete game shutout for Megan Schumacher. Missouri improves to 22 and six and takes back-to-back -back wins into a really important weekend, Ashley, opening up the home portion of the SEC schedule Friday afternoon against Auburn.